Arsenal Fan TV out here at Watford. Time to get into the player ratings. Good win for Arsenal. We needed that so badly. And uh, it was a fantastic three points in the end. Great first half performance. Second half, you've got to credit Watford. They really came back into it. They made it more physical, more aerial. And it, you know, they definitely put in a better performance. But we held out defensively. And uh, let's get into the player ratings. First of all, in goal, Petr Cech, I'm going to give him an 8 out of 10. He pulled off a couple of good saves in the second half that kept us into the game. He was assured. His kicking was very good. Petr Cech, 8 out of 10. At right back, Hector Bellerin, I thought, played very well today as well. Made some very, very good runs. Um, sometimes he could have dealt with the crosses a bit better, but I'm going to give him a 7 out of 10. Rob Holding, fantastic performance by Rob Holding. This guy's a young kid and he's coming into these games. And for a young kid like that to be up against guys like Troy Deeney, Igalo, very physical players, it can't be easy. 7 out of 10 for Rob Holding. This guy is looking like a player. Lauren Koscielny, I thought today, was absolutely superb, particularly in the first half. Dealt with everything. He's speed. He's a combative player. We so missed him in that first... Imagine if we'd had him against Liverpool. We wouldn't have lost that game. Eight out of ten for Lauren Koscielny. Brilliant. Nacho Monreal as well, I thought today, was absolutely fantastic before he came off with an injury. I'm hoping that's nothing too serious. But seven out of ten for Monreal. Played really well today. Sitting just in front of them, Granite Jacka. Now, Jacka today was absolutely phenomenal. His passing was brilliant. He's so strong on the ball. This is a future captain of Arsenal Football Club. I'm going to give Granite Xhaka today my man in the match. Nine out of ten. Next to him, Santi Cazola today, I thought, played really well as well. Particularly in the first half. He's the person who kept it ticking over. Scored the penalty as well that got us off the mark. Uh, Sani Cazola, good performance, 7 out of 10. Mesut Ozil as well, what a fantastic goal by him and also a good performance by him. You can see physically he started to drop, you know, he's just coming back with 7 out of 10 for Mesut Ozil. Alex Oxlade chamberlain a bit of an iffy game for the Ox. Uh, there was a couple of good moments, a couple of decent runs. But an iffy kind of game for him, not his best game. 6 out of 10 for Oxlade chamberlain on the other wing that I thought Theo Walcott today was brilliant today for me. Um, I was surprised I was interviewing a couple of guys before. And they were impressed with Theo. I thought today his work rate was spot on. He was a constant threat to Watford. 7 out of 10 for Theo. He's got to keep this up game in, game out. Up front, Alexis Sanchez. He played really well today, I thought. Still for me, not a striker. Still drops off too much. Still wants to be involved in the game a lot. But... Today he scored a goal, he was a constant threat, 8 out of 10 for Alexis. Substitutes Kieran Gibbs, I thought he came on, uh, didn't have a lot of time to affect the game but he did what he needed to do, coming into the sort of Lions Den, he did what he had to do and was solid, uh, 7 out of 10 for Gibbs. Um, Mohamed Elneny as well came on, looked decent again in the midfield, this guy, £5 million he costs, it's not always about the fee done very well when he, he came in, solidified things so that we could hold out. 7 out of 10 for El Nenny. And Jack Wilshire came on, was very feisty, got booked. Um, didn't really have a lot of time to affect the game. 7 out of 10 for Jack as well. Manager today, going to give him 7 out of 10. He got the tactics spot on. All right, maybe in the second half, a lot of fans will criticise him and say, why didn't we go for it more? But for me, it was important to get a win. You can go for it, get caught out and end up drawing a game that you should be winning. So for me, I think the tactics were spot on. At this stage of the season, you need the three points, and that's what we got. Manager, 7 out of 10. And the fans today, 8 out of 10, were in good voice. Everybody was positive. Nobody was slating off the manager or anything like that. I like that. Everybody was together. I think the fact that we'd heard about the signings before the game really put a lot of positivity into the fans. So big win here today at Watford. Um, we got to follow this up in our next few games but it's just good to get off the mark with a win at Arsenal. Anything can happen. If Leicester can win the league, anything can happen. Quadruple but yeah, it was, it was nice. I thought we going to win the league. Think, only beaten do you think? I thought we were going to beat who? And yet you said they're going to win the league. Oh, you said they're going to win Listen, the league. Not